Doesn't look like trail, does it? Nope. Outdoor adventure, RV park in Bethel, Maine. Second zero. Hopefully got some videos up today. I am had a gap in my stuff and I haven't been working on the videos and I gotta get my button gear. So that's what I'm gonna do some today. And um, Blue Plate wants to hang too, so. Uh, it should be good. Should be able to get some work done. Going to get some food now. Uh, I was resupplied yesterday. And uh, yeah, we're gonna eat something, try to stay on the budget plan and go from there. I'll catch up. Okay, aside from washing clothes, Olympus with only 150 miles on them, new kicks. I just showed you a little bit ago. Already coming loose on the Vibram soles. They're probably not made for the trail here. So I just washed them, so I gotta let them dry before the sun gets them, but look at, yeah, not good enough bonding. So I tried some double-sided tape and Gorilla Tape and it came off on the way to get food. So I'm gonna let them dry and then I'm gonna use this stuff called E6000 uh, on the Zero, take advantage of this day a little bit. See if it works. Okay, what do you do on a zero besides do videos? You get distracted. So, so the campground, campground has their own private island. They got a private suspension bridge. Check it out. I think that's Hastings over there. The secret code. The secret code. Got a secret code to open and close the gate. He's locking it. Ooh, it's wobbly. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna put the phone down for this. Though it is kind of fun climbing way the heck up here. A little scary, but fun. <laughs> all right. It's. <laughs> I mean, I'm climbing mountains all day, so this shouldn't bother me, but this is bothering me. <laughs> <Woo. laughs> Alright. Here we go. Cross the Hastings Island Suspension Bridge. I'm trying not to drop my phone. There's blue plate. And I'm kind of freaking out a little bit. Just a little bit freaking out. Because, you know, you're 60 feet above the water here. <laughs> no, maybe 40. Maybe 40. Maybe 50, 40 at the, the peaks. Kind of crazy. Ooh, this thing's bouncing up and down on me. Damn it. I don't like it. Woo. Okay. Uh, that's enough for now. I'm gonna put the phone in my pocket. I really want two hands on this bridge. Woo -hoo -hoo. See, it's kind of nuts. Oh gosh, it's bouncing around over this nice little piece of river. Um, Androscoggin. It's the Androscoggin River and we're going on to Hastings Island and uh, thanks for tagging along, but I'm gonna stick it in my pocket for now, okay? Okay. <laughs> Look at that dude up there. I'm gonna go on wide just so to dramatize this. Woo, look at that bridge. There's the river. This this piece of footage right here, man, makes it look like you're a mile high in the air on this bridge. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh yeah. Fixing shoes at camp on the zero. 
uh, beautiful, beautiful river here. Uh, totally could wade across this. Um, nice day. Couldn't have planned a better zero. Uh, we should be hiking, but hey, that's part of it. All right, I'll catch up. Holy cow, I'll tell you something. That thing, scary. <laughs> what did you think? That was, that was a little rough, man. <laughs> 4,000 foot mountains, you feel like you got the ground underneath you. But with this, it doesn't. <laughs> Just walking around Hastings Island, another through hiker took the time to uh, take his zeros as a work for stay and clean a couple feet to, eat to either side of the trail. Pretty nice. Um, yeah, pretty cool. This is island owned by the campground. The folks who own the campground and live here on this island that's a mile around um, circumference. So it's Nice little walking trail if you want to come and check out a part of Maine. Got a nice campground. Uh, they can even accommodate the big ones. Uh, I guess that's Class A. I'm not sure. Um, but, yeah, they've got tent sites as well that are super cool. And this hiker did a great job cleaning out the area. It's pretty cool. And it's right along the river here, too. Nice. Oh man, we just got into the stinging nettle. It's awful. The guy cleaned most of the trail, but holy cow, some parts there's stinging nettle all over this trail and dummies go in camp shoes and shorts. Dummies, oh my God. Still a cool island though. I mean, yeah, I would recommend um, wait until they finish cleaning up or, uh, wear, some or wear some pants. <laughs> all right, we're on our way back over the apex of the bridge and amongst the trees with the previous hiker sock the guy who probably did the trail uh, trail maintenance yeah Did it. I actually did the whole way back without holding on to the railing. I can't even believe it. What an effort and balance that was. Holy smokes. Very cool. So I glued the heck out of my shoes. I glued the flap. I glued the surrounding area of foam. Let's see what happens. I'll keep it posted. <laughs> 